All right, everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're gonna hang some four foot LED shop lights in our shed. Let me show you what I bought. Let me show you where I'm gonna put them. And yeah, let's go ahead and get rolling. Thanks for coming along on this journey uh, with the shed transformation. I've been having fun with this. I hope you guys have been enjoying the video. So yeah, let's go ahead and keep it rolling. All right, everybody, here we go. So this is what we bought, commercial electric, um, maintenance free LED, 50,000 hours, blah, blah, blah. Um, they are four foot, 3,200 lumen uh, shop lights. So let's go ahead. I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna hang one here. This is our um, loft. We have two lofts in the shed, if you've been following along on the uh, build series. So I think we're gonna hang one here. We're gonna hang one there. I think that'll broadcast enough light down here, um, the 10 by 12 shed. So let's go ahead and open it, check it out, drill and hang, and off we go. All right, so I'm not in any time or place to spend, you know, thousands of dollars on, you know, lighting. We just bought, I think these were 30, $37 a light. I have two of them downstairs on my workbench and I was pretty happy with them. So let's go ahead and uh, let's take one out of here, check it out. And then we should get to hanging. All right. Let's carefully, carefully put that there. So we got them hung, we got them centered, we got them hung. We have the connecting wire there. Obviously we're gonna clean up all this wiring. We'll try to tuck it up uh, underneath. We might even tuck the, uh, we might even tuck the um, lights up farther than that. But this is just kind of basically to see how they look and how they perform. So yeah, let's put you guys on the tripod and um, yeah, we'll plug you in. All right, so unless unless I forgot to say it, I don't know if I did or not, but we have no power out here. We're just running an extension cord off of the uh, outlet by the pool. The pool's only about 30 feet from the shed, so yeah. Go ahead, let there be light. Wow. <laughs> that looks pretty good. Let's pop you guys off here. Wow. Those look really good, super bright. Wow. At least now if I wanna come out here and, and work or do something, I can just run the extension cord over, run it up through the wall there and yeah, boom, let there be light. What do you guys think? I think that looks pretty good. Not bad at all. All right, so just a little update on um, our shop lighting here. This is what we ended up doing after I was in and out a few times. I actually needed the ladder to fill the bird feeders and I almost pulled all the lights off because the ladder got hung up. So what we did was I raised and flush mounted the lights. As you can see there, I ran a two by four. Again, we got a million two by fours, so I really don't care. I ran the two by fours over and then I stapled with electrical staples. I stapled the connecting wire over, obviously flush mounted this light and then try to take this in one shot so bear with me here um then i came over here same thing ran it up stapled it it's whatever i mean i'm not a professional electrician so and then i ran it here and there's our extension cord that plugs in by our pool here so for now i think this will do so anyways um yeah that takes care of the shop lighting 